Nice. I don't think I've played like I've ha I've hardly played any GBA games for RA. I might have to set my controls, right? Because my pause emulator is going to be like A button. The, the title screens are really cool. play the whole game on easy, can't I? Can I change it later? I could start on normal and then do easy later. I might do easy. I mean, I guess it's your game request, Flashfire. If you want me to play on normal, I'll play on normal. I hope you don't tell me to play on hard. Because there's no achievement for that, so it would be, like, pointless. Yeah, you may as well do it. Thank you. Thank you for your understanding. The guards won't let me waltz out the gate of this dungeon. Nice. I need to press A. A is my pause emulator. That's not that's not gonna work. Let's change that right now. It's all good. Nice, look at that parrot. Use the control pad to move left and right, alright. Press down to make jack crouch, alright. shrink my OBS a little. I'm not used to um, this resolution, you know? Game Boy Advance resolution! <laughs> Game Boy Advance resolution, whatever that is. We love Game Boy Advance. Look at it, look at that animation of it, just him standing there. It's really cool. Thank you, Flashfire. If you can't sneak by him, you'll have to fight. Press the B button to swing your sword. Or if you'd prefer to leap over him, press the A button to jump in the air. Alright. The red bar is my health bar. Each time an enemy hits you, the meter is reduced a little bit. If it disappears completely, you're done for. Enemies may drop life good close. Nice. I love the damage pop out. That's like so Symphony of the Night. And considering like a lot of people bought Game Boy Advances for the Castlevania games, if they were to like tr be trying to cash in on that, I'm okay with it. You know? Hell yeah. Because we know it works well. We know that style of game works well on GBA.
I really think like A and B should be reversed though. So like this should be jump and this should be attack, but instead this is attack and this is attack. I've got to switch that as well even, and then it's going to be confusing because they're going to be like press A and I'm going to be like okay oh I switched it it's okay once we get the controls right I mean certain games have reverse controls it's okay it's common It's so confusing, you have to like, there's like two places you can change your controls at least. That doesn't seem right. I mean, maybe that's part of the problem? So this should be, uh, for, for this game, this should be A. This can be just B. No, that should be Y, isn't it? No, because Game Boy Advance only has... Oh, Game Boy Advance only has those buttons. I forgot. Alright, so A and B... Okay, save game. I'm not sure I did that right. I'm not sure I did that right. Good enough for now. Good enough for now. I'm... L okay, the camera is like... It's... Very intense. The whole camera jerks very quickly when you move left and right. So far the camera is like the one thing, the first thing I don't like. So far it's just been one way, right? Well, maybe there's secrets. Like maybe down there. It feels like I already been that way, but never really know. Ah, uh, how do I get up there? Alright, I gotcha. Legendary treasure, idol of Cuckoo Can. Oh, that's double jump. Yes. This game just got twice as good. Wow, they gave it to me so early too. That's awesome. Love that shit. Love double jump. I love double jumps. I love jetpacks. Oh, I love mutton chops. I love his mutton chops. Mm -hmm. 
Set a course for Tortuga. Oh shit, sailing. For now, your first mate will steer. You're too exhausted to command this vessel. You're right. Now I can go get the other chest. Shit, I missed the chest, didn't I? Shiver me timbers, cure the pain with games. Welcome. This is a viewer request from Flashfire. He steered me toward a hostile ship, so he didn't do a very good job, I guess. All hands to cannons. Why is the parrot the fucking tutorial narrator? I guess because Zelda the owl, so the parrot in this game. Time to fight. Pressing A button will fire all the cannons. And B button will be on the other side. If I have multiple types, press the what button? L to cycle. Yes, the parrot is a wise, all-knowing being. I love it. Can I slow the fuck down? Like, oh my gosh, I'm booking it. Fucking booking it. If I die, it sends you back to prison, so you want that last chest, you'll eventually need to go back to the prison. This is basically Assassin's Creed 4. are time to pillage and plunder take whatever you can but be wary of other pirates so I need to go back to the prison I gotcha but I'm not exactly sure why but there was a treasure there I missed Oh shit, he hit me. Wow, this is pretty awesome. This is basically Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. I unlock slide kick. Hell yeah. See the combo menu? There's a combo menu. This combo menu. Well, nice. Ford Ford B. What? Awesome. Fucking dash attacks. Oh, this is so good. This is so Castlevania. This makes me want to play Castlevania. Thank you, Flashfire, for showing me this game. I wonder what that... I wonder what some of these things do. That just looks like background, but it also looks like a treasure. <laughs> Some of the combos are pretty difficult, yeah. Right, right. 
did um was this game getting good reviews or did somebody just like buy you this game and you're like okay how'd you um were you just like trying to beat like all game boy advance games you love pirates there's so, so many reasons why you might know this game I played a lot of Game Boy Advance games just because, like, I had all the ROMs. Ooh. Oh, buy budget GBA games on eBay? That's awesome. And then this was just, this just happened to be a budget GBA game, and you had it as a, on a cartridge. That's awesome. awesome when your mom like finds you a good game okay so I think your recommendation was to go back to the prison My instinct would be to go forward. Try again. Select the town icon and press A. Okay, well, they really want me to visit town. I just roll into town with my sword out. I have to actually die in game to go back to the prison. Oh, okay. Nothing to purchase today, sir. The British Navy commandeered every bit of stock in this port. Her face looks so good. The pixel art? Game Boy Advance seriously was advanced. It just blew my mind. I was like, what I said to my brother, I was like, it's like having a Super Nintendo in your pocket. They're sending me to the beach. It's beautiful. Poor little crabs. Dang, it's like Ninja Gaiden. Pirate Gaiden. Yes, kill those red coats. Okay, quicksand, death by quicksand. Um, no offense to any red coats. I like those coats actually. I would wear one. I would wear one and the tricone hat. And then, like, everyone would probably shoot me. That quicksand is hard to get out of. I could see myself dying in that quicksand.
These must be the goods. Yay, I got the goods. I guess I just need to go back and talk. Yes, achievement, achievement. Leaping lemurs. I love that, leaping lemurs. Where am I going? I'm sailing. I need to set sail. Equip my ship. Oh, nice. I have a better... Better sail. Cool. That's awesome that you can do that. Before heading out, check the wind direction. Dang. I didn't mean to, like, attack. I don't know how to not be, um, going. Kind of brutal. Did they tell me where to go? San Merlo. Did they say go to San Merlo? This game seems huge right now. Maybe it's not actually huge, but it seems huge right now. I wish I was leveling up and I wish there was something I could spend my money on. That's my wish list right now. I just remembered I can double jump. Shipyard is a shop. Oh, thank you. Oh, yes. Oh, 
Oh, yes. Better cannons. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Oh, this is so great. Bronze cannon, yes. And I want the rapier. But I also want the peasant shirt. Shoot. Okay, I can sell my old sails. gives me enough for the shirt. Yeah, yeah. Go go into my ship to equip the item. Okay. And then I could even sell my old hail shot cannon. see what was in town. Oh, my thing looks different. That's awesome. Oh, I should pay for these, right? This is how you learn where the treasures are. I don't know if I can buy them all right now. I gotcha. No gold, I ran out of gold. Still, that was cool. sell my old cannon to buy rumors <laughs> makes total sense yes that's just life that's the life of a pirate different buttons start and select because I'm not using triangle and circle on my pad those could be start and select that'd be more convenient I think what I was looking for was like my rapier and my um, it here no I don't see it listed anywhere My equipment. It's okay, but I just am looking for it. I don't see it. You're just supposed to know. You're just supposed to remember. That snake looks awesome. This game's pretty cool. I like it.
Oh shit. Kitty, I don't want to kill the kitty. Basically, Monster Hunter. Oh, okay, it automatically upgrades your weapon. I do see that the the sword is a different color here. I thought maybe it would be represented in my status screen somewhere. I didn't see it though. In the shirt, but it's all good. Yeah, weapons are auto equipped. That's what it seems like. Killing this island. Just exploring islands, collecting loot. It's kind of like Sonic. It's kind of like that Sonic game where he has a sword. I do like that the sword changes color. Like uh, Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. I got the tempered sword right now. That the um, the little gnome blacksmiths make for you. Or are they dwarves? Or are they just like regular people? Regular Hyruleans. see how long have I been streaming six and a half hours I might be able to play another hour and a half but I do need to like eat something during I need to take a break and eat something uh, thank you I am enjoying it thank you flash fire I was just considering like playing it for like five hours or something, but I gotta I gotta wake up tomorrow kinda early. Eat, eat, eat. Alright, I will eat when I am ready to eat. Thank you for the eating permission. Yes, yes. Yes. I like his jumping animation. This game, this is the kind of game that makes you like love Pirates of the Caribbean, you know? It's like, fuck the movies, the game for Game Boy Advance, that's the game. That's my shit. It's like, yeah, you, you know Castlevania, but do you know Pirates of the Caribbean? Slicing them. Basically, this is like Assassin's Creed. Oh, I started running. I need to run more. I love that. Oh, wow. Look at that mustache.
He's wearing my bowling shirt. Alright, so he gave me another location to check out. I'll probably go have some cereal. Cereal or ramen? Ramen takes longer. We'll see how I feel when I get down there. I bought all the things. These weren't for sale before. His inventory totally changed. How dare his inventory change? Absolutely ridiculous. You scurvy dog. I love any game that calls you scurvy dog. Bootstrap Bill Turner. They did a good job of converting the movie into like the Game Boy pixels. Like it doesn't look terrible, but I don't know where I'm going. I really don't know where I'm going. Town, that's where I wanted to go. Oh, San Merlot Shoreline. I should have had that before I went there. I will save. So many islands to visit. It's so many islands! <gasps> you can even look. Oh my gosh, I didn't know you could do this. <gasps> I didn't know you could do this. I didn't know. I didn't know. Alright, what it really seems like to me is I should go through the game, going where it tells me to go. Wow, look at the face in the background. That's spooky. That's Davy Jones, right? I'm pretty sure. So I think I should just go through the game, do the locations, buy the rumors, and then, like, at the final save, like at the final checkpoint, then go around collecting the treasures. That's what it seems like I should do. So it's basically like two playthroughs, sort of. Alright, let, let me go get some snacks. Whoa! I'll be right back. I'll be right back. And then I'll play this for like another hour. And then bedtime. Thank you, Flashfire, for the request. Thank you, Connor, for the raid. Flashfire for the cheers. Tav got a game request in earlier. Yeah, somebody unfollowed me. No, thank you for that.
I like that there's um, a destination on the map too. I just saw my meters go down. I should probably stock up on food and grog for the shippies, the shipmates, the crew. The crew. Cannibal Cove? Wow, that background looks great. I'm guessing if there's like a ledge that leads to nowhere that a treasure would be there if I had heard the rumor. I'm guessing that's that's the idea there. The levels are really short. Not that that's good or bad, just state facts. Cannon shot combo, hell yeah. Let's check that out. B, B, forward and B. Hell yeah. Oh, I love it. It's fucking Ken Master Shuriken. Oh, the range is not great. It's okay though. There was a secret back up here, but that doesn't mean I have that treasure unlocked, even if there was. Whoa, shit. I hope they don't respawn. There we go. Oh, uh, there's like nothing here.
Oh, if I had a little bit better weapon, that would have killed him. That combo. Let me see if I can get that. Yeah, the melee saber. I need that, but I can't afford it yet. I also need food and grog. I mean, I don't know what happens when you run out. Maybe that would be like a death. And that would put me back in the prison. So it might not be the worst thing. That was pro. This game is fun. <coughs> I mean, think about it. We've spent all day with Godzilla. I might start using these sub weapons more. This shit's annoying. Ah. got a little bit confused about if I had been that way yet, yet or not. Hundred gold. Uh, 
Now this level is not short at all. So clearly not all the levels are going to be super short and easy. Nice, I poisoned my um, dagger or rapier. Dang, it's basically Dark Souls. The heart of an old sailor. What? What's happening? Captain, we ain't alone. I didn't quite finish exploring that level. <laughs> but considering that I might not have rumors there's no point in doing it again until I have all the rumors can I climb this vine? yes I can climb animation looks good Tarzan over here. Oh, look at that move. Piranhas are cool. Give me Spelunky vibes. Mosquito Marsh, oh no. I hate mosquitoes. Is there a kitty coming in? Is there a kitty cat? Who's coming in? Zora? Shista? Kitty might be <clears throat> stuck on the backpack. Hold on. Oh, 
I need those bananas. Ooh, that restored a lot. This looks like a chest would be here if I knew the rumor. I guess I don't even really have to fully explore the levels because I'm just going to find areas where there should be chests, but there aren't any. I did that slide on accident. Beautiful. Is this based off in the second movie? Or are these stills from the second movie? I didn't see that one. No, I don't need to. See, you're saving me time. I don't have to see the movie now. Look, and he has conveniently new location. Where is it though, exactly? Is there a faster way to scroll? There it is, there it is. Alright. It's just west. Never would have guessed that. Well, oh. okay, I see now. One arrow is the wind, one arrow is my destination. I got it now. It took me until now. Oh, the crew's not performing well today. Do I really have to buy them food and grog? I really don't want to. You know, I need all my gold for me. It honestly seems like a waste of money. If you're just going to get a game over and then, like, have free refills when you get out of jail, you know what I mean? It feels like you could save the money. Provisions are running low. Mutiny, the crew has rebelled. Well, I was hoping I would get to the next dock and be able to save before that happened. So, um, what happened? I got thrown in jail immediately. Thrown in jail immediately. Um, did I lose, like, a bunch of stuff? No, I still have gold. I still have a million active rumors. Wow, 
Well, I guess I saved money by not um, <laughs> buying food or grog for my crew. Oh, okay, I couldn't get that before, I gotcha. Yes. But I, once I got the double jump, I could have run back down here. But since I was probably gonna die anyway at some point. I felt like there was more. You ever feel like there's more ways you can go, and then it's like, no, I don't know, I'm bad at navigation and spatial awareness. so awesome I did a backwards kick did you see that I can't even redo it I can't even repeat it maybe an enemy has to be standing there that was awesome I was just trying to turn around and fucking check did a back kick that was awesome did not mean to do this can I escape from combat feel like you cannot escape. Oh, it isn't like you to abandon the fight. Are you sure you want to flee? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay, I can loot it. I can loot it now. Hey. Ooh, blue coat and treasure. It was like a hundred gold. That looked like food for the crew. It's like a fork and spoon. I guess these are all optional, but I feel like the money will help me right now. I guess I should have spent money on not getting the game over. But the money that I saved by not feeding my crew, you know, it's my first playthrough. It's hard to know the best best thing to do. The 
cannon and 300 gold. I guess I could have bought, I could have checked out that island, unless I've already been to that one. the port or the shipyard all right I need to buy something I need to buy the, the new weapon I've been dying to get that oh single segment bronze cannon is that identical to what I'm using It has like better handling. What does that mean exactly? I don't know, but it has five points total instead of four points. You know what I mean? It's worth more than my current one. I'm so close to the bronze scimitar now. Oh, I kind of want to save. I mean, as as much as I want this kind of cotton tunic, I also want the bronze scimitar, like, even more. I'm going to save. I haven't saved in a while. Since before I found Will. Because I found Will and then I was going to the next location and I ran out of food. My crew did a mutiny. Oh. We'll have to speak with Tia Dama. Look, it's Orlando Bloom. We'll need a gift. Find her a new pet. A pet monkey? You mean little Jack? Get that monkey. zombies now? Skellies? Oh, I wish I had the upgraded sword. It's like two more damage. We're going on a holiday. Oh, 
Oh, he said the same thing again. Oh shit, did Jack go up there? What the hell? Yeah, you don't remember this part. I understand. I would have blocked this out of my memory as well. It seems like if you just keep going, the monkey is there. So, I was just overthinking it. Not necessarily the best programmed part of the game, you know. just expect you to keep going but if you happen to look backwards though you might find a monkey crazy zombie monkey that's the, that's his words Like, maybe in the movie it was a zombie monkey, like, and that's why you're able to kill it. I spent too much money on rumors. Little, yeah, little Jack is a zombie. Right, he stole the gold coin. I became a zombie. I remember that hidden scene. I stayed past the credits for that hidden scene. The movie attendants definitely don't want you to stay for the hidden scenes. They want you out of there so they can clean. Yep, he stole the he stole one in the post credits scene. I remember that. He like jumps at the camera and like makes you like go ah! I think I think that happened. Oh, 
there is like some random there's a random jump scare in the middle of some exposition in the first spider-man movie that was just like so unexpected that it was actually hilarious it's just like the green goblin just like just like for like two frames you link to YouTube is that the monkey the silly monkey found a link you found a link get back here little Jack I'm starting to get sleepy let me see how long have I been going all right Shit, sorry. I um <laughs> It's the monkey stealing the coin. I accidentally minimized the chat and I was like, wait, where's my chat? Oh shit. I'm getting sleepy. I'm gonna try to keep playing. Try to go to eight hour stream. That's in thirty minutes. I need that health upgrade. <laughs> I understand. Thank you for your understanding as well. We'll see when I find a good stopping space or a place. back to this game in three years when I do every GBA game. Hell yeah. Now you're talking. Ooh, pistol shot combo. I keep pressing the wrong button. Good times, good times. Oh, what? Down. Oh, okay. It's like a Hadouken. It's a fireball motion. Okay. Gotcha.
crap, I might die. Oh no, that would be awful. I'm about to die. Fuck. Back to the prison, right? No, it wasn't back to the prison. As you said, some of them are pain, like some of these levels. No problem. Are you thinking about every GBA game? <laughs> you just like to play it. Most people just play the games they want to play. And, you know, I got burned out. I'm burned out right now on every NES game. I'm gonna play what I wanna play now. I mean, for a while. At least a couple days. Other than viewer requests, of course. Viewer requests are good too. Master this game, honestly. Like, I don't see why I shouldn't. Cause then you just you just beat it and then go again. You just beat it and then do it again with all the rumors and get all the treasures. Doing more NES since you bought your NES controller. Cool. streaming at all? Should I follow you? Look at this first mate. I didn't realize you could um, do crew management. You don't stream, you don't have a camera. Oh, you can stream without a camera. Time Soccer streams without a camera. I was watching someone today with just his silhouette, and he had like 1.7 thousand followers. But you know, if you don't, if you don't want to, you don't want to, it's fine. sure people want to hear your lovely voice or even if you don't have a camera or a mic like people still want to like see you be a pro if you have a ps4 which you might not but my friend Todd doesn't have a mic or camera and he he has like the voice to text on, so when you type a comment, it says in a robot voice. It's pretty fun too. As long as people don't abuse it, it's fun. 
it's usually just me like saying go Todd go and then the robots like go Todd go and then he pulls out his phone and like says lol I'm trying and then the voice is like lol I'm trying oh my gosh I don't even want to fight that person I can't keep up like, I'm damaged. I need repairs. I can fast forward this. Oh, they're trying to fucking fight me. Oh, they're gonna kill me. I can barely move. Damn, back in the prison. Okay, so that really showed me that I need to invest in better defense for my boat. So I'm definitely learning. Because I kind of felt like I was invincible. This game is pretty cool though, um, Flash Fire. It's like a good combination of you know, Castlevania action, a couple RPG elements, a couple of like pirate elements, and it's not so advanced. Like a game, a game like Pirates, like Sid Meier's Pirates, is very intimidating to me. But then in this, it's like very simplified. You know what I mean? And this, it's like, here's your, here's your food meter, here's your grog meter, here's your ship's health, here's the three things you can upgrade for your ship. That's it. Done. There's crew management, but I haven't seen recruitable crew, so I don't even know what the point of that menu is. But, um, pretty cool game. It's like, you know, baby's first pirate sailing simulator, and I appreciate that, because I'm not good at those. Alright, where are we going, where are we going, where are we going? I see, the prison island has no dot that you can dock on. Is it pointing me way over there? It can't be. Can it? Oh, it's up there. Okay, I gotcha. Oh, don't fight me. Don't fight me. Oh, my boat is still all fucked up? Dang. I thought my boat was just going to be magically fixed. Just like my food and grog was magically replenished. Except maybe it wasn't magically replenished. Oh, I feel like I'm stuck, honestly. I'm feeling stuck. Alright, here we go. Rum Runners Island. I really just want to visit the shop. This is what I wanted, though, the brown scimitar. I have just enough to repair the ship. I'm going to do that. Because my ship blew up, right? My ship blew up when I ran out of food and water, or food and grog. Ooh, demi cannon. When I ran out of food and grog, I died, and then my food and grog was replenished. But when I, when my ship blew up, I died and my ship was still fucked up. Oh, look at my scimitar. It looks awesome. Are there no rumors here? Or he's just not prepared to tell me right now? 
What is this demi cannon? Okay, so it's not. I don't think it's as good as what I'm using. Let me save. I'm having a blast. I'm like super into this. But this is not the island I wanted to go to. It's just a pit stop. They've been running combat drills poorly. Is that because I'm getting low on stuff? The first mate is now sailing. The British Navy, nothing but hooligans, lashings, and captain warships set up a blockade. Oh shit, combat. Mess them up. Alright, I'm just waiting for it to sail off, I guess. See you later. International war achievement, hell yeah, a bit of a scrape, nothing more. You can't keep challenging the British Navy head on like that. No, why not? For a dead man, the flying Dutchman. Looks like we're getting ambushed. Prepare a boat for this fearless adventurer. 13 years as captain of the Black Pearl. <laughs> oh, really? Around here, if you haven't already caught gone too far uh, you won't you think I should go and get the treasures because this is near the end of the game really whoa you're blowing my mind with that one you're really blowing my mind Alright, thanks to your tip, Flashfire, I'm going to start using the slot 2 in case I'm past the point of no return. So if I set sail, the map is telling me to 
go back to Tortuga. But you're telling me I should like get the treasures now. Oh shit. Alright, if I don't get a decently upgraded ship and all the treasures, I'll have to redo the game to get them all. Really? Seems like you know what you're talking about, so yeah, I don't I don't wanna like fuck up my run. Epic music from the movie. Alright, let me try to like work on upgrading my ship and stuff. Yeah, I'm I'm not really supposed to be on this island. I just thought I would explore it for like possible treasure. There's a tough ship battle near the end of the game. All right. Good to know these things. Thank you, Flashfire. Cause I was just gonna blaze through the game and then, you know, do like a second pass through each area, but I guess you're telling me that's not a good strategy because that's like what Maddie, that's what Maddie was trying to do maybe, or maybe not exactly like that, but Maddie ran into some problems. I should follow Maddie. I don't ever watch Maddie. I mean, they have t He has. I think he. I think his pronouns are he him. He's got TV right in his name. It's pretty cool, you can just go to an island and explore. Like, you don't have to progress the storyline, just go see what's going on. Thank you, Flashfire, you saw me on a path, path of destruction. Path of my own destruction. I'm having a hard time jumping in. Oh, it only has 11. I was hoping for like 50. Look, it takes so long to come out.
cool, cool level. I like that background. enemies respond well. Just jumped on my lap. Just making a bed now. Whoa, making a bed. Sweet kitten. She looked at me. She looked at me. I saw a treasure. Shit, I'm not having a uh, having a struggle. Treasure, legendary, Poseidon's horn, yes. So what good is treasure though? Because it doesn't seem to upgrade my ship at all. And I didn't see a way to sell it. I mean, it's good for the achievement. But I don't see how it helps me upgrade my ship. But I've only found legendary treasures, so I maybe the regular treasures help me. Very 
very generous that the spikes do one damage. Spikes kill you in a lot of games. Instantly. Legendary treasures can unlock combos, that makes sense. Normal treasures are required to recruit crewmates. Oh, thank you. That does make sense because I saw that crewmate menu. I'm like, how do you get crewmates? Okay. Okay. Sometimes you find a dude to join your crew from the rumors and he will say you have to have these three treasures first. Okay. should go somewhere close. I'm probably gonna run out of food before I make it. send you right to fucking naughty jail.
can't wait to one-shot them. I know I can one-shot these guys. I want to one-shot everybody. I want to one-shot you. I want to one-shot you. Tortuga is where the storyline progresses. So I think I want to avoid that place. Oh my god, they killed me. Huh. Do you lose money on death? I don't know for sure. I didn't think that you did. So what are these things I'm picking up? Maybe that's why I thought my food came back. Because I just found a bunch in the in the prison. I don't know. I don't know all the mechanics. I feel like I have to go to Tortuga to repair. I'm just gonna keep dying. I'm in a death loop right now. How is there more ships? Oh my gosh. How is there another ship? bag is food, the barrels are grog, that makes sense. Ooh. Once again, nestled in the cheeriest port for miles. Now remember lads, we're here for manpower. Aye, Captain. Talk to every last man and bring him aboard. Tell him that a pirate's life is just the thing for his future prospects. 
who, sir, this town's full of drunks and criminals mostly. Would you deny a fellow man this charitable offer? I want to teach people, guide them to a better, different life. Right, Captain, whatever you say. I need a ship repair desperately. And I really do need this cotton tunic. As much as I want the brass cutlass. Nothing to sell. Is it town? They told me to come here. I guess I'm not sure what to do though. Explore. It might be time to stop. Yeah, it's past time to stop. But, um, this has been great. This has been great. I'm gonna continue this sometime. I'm pretty into it right now. I would keep playing, but it is time. Thank you, Flashfire. For the request, let me find somebody to raid.